Wonderful reception for both teams. The present moment, Sheffield United have taken the field and have brought a good number of supporters with them and they're making themselves fully heard. for the home side. I should imagine there's a good 10 to 12,000 spectators, the biggest gate that we've had at Chesterfield for quite a while. And to give you a rundown on the teams, for Chesterfield, in goal, Mick Leonard. Number two, Hool. Three, Steve Prindeville. Four, Bob Bloomer. Five, Tony Bryan. Six, Trevor Slack. Seven, Kevin Ely. Eight, Adrian Shaw. Number nine, Dave Waller. Number 10, Jamie Hewitt. And Andy Morris our art trick hero on Tuesday at number 11 with Rogers and Rolf as substitutes. The lineup for Sheffield United is Graham Benstead in goal, Brian Smith at number two, Martin Pike number three, Bob Bloom at Booker number four, Paul Stantliff at number five with Steve Thompson number six, Peter Duffield, number seven, Mark Todd, eight, Tony Agana, nine, and ten, Brian Dean. These are the two that are getting the goals and quite a number for Sheffield United with Ian Bryson at number 11. Substitutes being Ian Bryson, uh, substitutes of correction being Francis and Cannon. Chesterfield lost the toss with the kicking off towards the cross street end. Conditions perfect, good drying wind has uh, taken the moisture out of the soil and it's uh, taking uh, a, a good stud. Chesterfield kick off, Brian down the left hand side, Morris but uh, cut out by Smith. Young Jamie Hull with his first kick forward to Wallop, cut out. But it's Ely with the ball down the right-hand side. Unfortunately, the flag is up. Morris in an offside position.
Martin Pike, long ball down right into the art of the Chesterfield defence, a good head out. Boyce like. And the ball is out for a throw in to Chesterfield down the right hand side, taken by uh, Richard Ewell. out directed towards uh, Morris a good backhead Healy trying to get inside his marker still Healy and uh, first foul of the game to Chesterfield good position in these early minutes Hewitt was Waller safely held by goalkeeper Benstead to kicks towards uh, Agana, who is uh, brought down by Brian. Play in midfield still and there's a sort out at present moment in these early minutes looks as though it's going to be a bounce up Slack and Buka <laughs> safely back to goalkeeper Leonard Kicks high past the centre circle. Morris tries to get a backhead to it, but it's Stantliff out to his left and goes out. The throw in, quickly taken to Ely. Out for the first corner kick to Chesterfield down the right hand side. on the near post covered by uh, Dean and we've got uh, Bloomer on the back end good one nodded out carried on and there's a deflection by a defender put in the net but uh, not allowed. The linesman's flag had been up for plenty of time. Goalkeeper Benstead. Long ball directed towards Deans. Good head by Slack. But it's uh, Duffield. Trying to get a ball forward, but it's some foot finished it up at the other end and a back pass to uh, goalkeeper Benstead. Kicks right hand side, goes loose to Duffield, carries it on to Dean, but Trevor Slack covering, puts it out for throw in. Down the line of the Chesterfield penalty area, right hand side. Be a long throw by Paul Stanicliffe. Good long throw, good head, coming loose. And the ball is cleared out, picked up by. Uh, Thompson out to his left, where number nine, Agana, is fouled. 
a good position for Sheffield United. Be right for in swinger by Driffield. Good Ed Morris trying to get on the end of it. And an overhead kick by Brian. Goes back towards the chestful goalkeeper. Punches out. Coming out to Bryson. Kicked out by Waller. Actually, miss, miss kick. Fortunately, goes back to uh, goalkeeper Leonard. A bit of pressure from Sheffield at the present moment as Leonard kicks. Halfway inside the Sheffield United half, going out for a throw in to Chesterfield by the right hand corner flag. To Bola. And the flag is up for offside. The referee hasn't seen it yet. Play is carried on. And as they try to get uh, Agana down the left hand side, it's Shaw to Bloomer. Filed by Booker. So, eight minutes play. Chessville nil, so, uh, uh, Sheffield United nil. Good chip forward by Brian, backhead by Morris. Headed out by Stancliffe, picked up by Hewitt. On the left angle of the penalty area, out to Prinderville. A good cross, cut out by Smith. But uh, put down the left hand side of the penalty area by Slack. But uh, safely covered by Thompson. As Ely was trying to get it onto it. Sheffield United have got a 2-2-2-2-2 two, 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 uh, two, uh, two, uh, formation from that goal kick, which is coming out towards uh, Agana. Still Agana to uh, Smith, but uh, he's over it. it. Leonard kicks, good long one. And it's the back head going out for a corner off for uh, Thompson. So, even Stephen, at the present moment, as Hewitt prepares to take this uh, corner kick, so in swinger. Waller is on the far post with Bloomer. Brian going in on the centre. There's a back head. And if on the top of the net. Kick by Benstead. Shaw trying to get to it, but it's Driffield. Shaw finally gets it to Prinderville. Down the line, cut out. Oh, goes off the edge of Smith's boot for a throw in. More or less level with the Sheffield United penalty area. Being brought back. Waller covered. Fighting for it. Comes loose to Shaw. Chip down the left hand side, but uh, unfortunately a little bit too sh a little bit too sharp. And uh, Waller caught in an offside position. Instead, good long kick, directed towards Dean, but a good head by Slyke. 
picked up by Smith. Down into the penalty area. It's Tagana with a cross, but uh, not a good one. Goes safely wide for a goal kick. Good kick towards Morris, but it's a good head by Thompson, picked up by uh, Shaw, but it's going out for another throw in. Prindeville, put out by Thompson, but it's another throw in, more or less, from the same spot by Prindeville. Good backhead by Morris in left angle of the penalty area, but it's uh, Duffield tries to get on the end of it, but it's Shaw to Ely. Too many bodies there to get into that penalty area, but it's a deflection for uh, oh what what a chance for Bruno kicked off his toes by Smith, who in the same instance has received an injury. Well, that uh, could have been uh, one up for Chesterfield. Action, Prindeville, well inside the uh, art of the uh, Sheffield United defence. Waller trying to get in onto it to Hewitt, and it's Thompson out for another throw in near the left hand corner flag. Morris is coming a bit near it. A good throw, and it's out. By Thompson. Shaw gets ahead to Prindeville into the penalty area. But it's Dean going forward, but um, covered by Slack, overhead kick. But unfortunately, Morris hasn't had a chance to get back as Ben Stead kicks. Good long one coming out wide to the field. Cross, a good early cross. And a good head by uh, Brian Dean. Completely unmarked. Left hand side. Just slightly forward of the six yard box. Green ball receives from uh, Leonard. Cut out by Thompson. It's like in the centre circle. A good long ball forward. But. Uh, too long for Ely to get on the end of. Will be throwing to Sheffield United. A few yards from their left hand corner flag defending. Directed towards Deans. But it's uh, Hull. But it can only put it out for another throw in. Dean backheads could only put it out for throwing this time to Chesterfield by the halfway line, right hand side. Good backhead from a defender to Ely, but uh, referee blows.
picked up by Todd. Up in the air, down the left-hand side, not a good one. Throw in, chest field. Backhead by Morris. Heel is out, jumped. By uh, Pike. Hull into Bloomer. Up in the air, down to Ely. But uh, flag is up once again for offside. <laughs> 16 uh, minutes play, it's still uh, Chesterfield nil, Sheffield United nil. In uh, this important local derby. Good head by Prinderville, picked up by uh, Smith. And Hewitt trying to put the ball forward, can't get at it clean. Goes out for a throw in. Thompson with this throw just inside just for laugh. Dean's coming over, no doubt, to receive this long ball. Good head by Slyke. Kept in by Waller. No. The referee judged it to have gone out. Quick throw by Driffield to Garner. Tries to turn inside his defender, Brinderville, but it's Bloomer trying to clear the ball, but uh, can't get a clear uh, shot, and it deflects for uh, a throw-in. Well inside their own half, Brinderville. few yards from that throw, Prindeville once again, hands on uh, Morris by Booker, not given, so it's Thompson with this throw, down the right hand side, backhead by Booker, picked up by uh, Slack to Bloomer, and Ely playing safe, puts it back to his goalkeeper. So Leonard, good long kick, deep inside the uh, Chef United half, and a backhead by Morris. A bit too long for anybody to take advantage of. Benstead kicks Agana to Dean. Dean down the uh, to his left, but picked up by Hull to Ely. Still Ely back to Hull. Long ball forward to Morris to Ely, and brought down. This is twice the same player. Martin Pike, I think it is, goes into the ball. Brian towards Morris, backhead towards Waller. Got a shot in, but deflected out and cleared by Thompson. Brian putting the ball back up, down the right hand side, but the flag is up for offside. So I would say at the present moment that Thompson is they're uh, doing some good work for Sheffield United in their defence. Good long kick towards Dean, goes through to Agana, brings it down to his right to Duffield inside Hewitt, plays the ball to uh, Smith. But unfortunately, it was too far behind him. Throw in up to Waller. A good long ball. Cross field ball to Ely. Turns. Bloomer. Into the penalty area, but not a very good ball from Bloomer. Oh, 
Another good long kick by Benstead. It's a good head by Prinderville. Jamie Hewitt tries to keep it in. But it's on the halfway line, down the right-hand side for uh, Thompson, who will be taking this uh, throw. Dean's coming over. Backhead inside the penalty area, but Brian covering uh, Pagana. Safely back to Leonard, who kicks, picked up by Thompson. Players offside. And at last, the referee acknowledges it. Can't understand referees having the back to a linesman that's on. Brian to Morris. Inside to Hewitt, back to Prinderville, chip forward to Little Ely. It uh, runs away from him, out safely. For a goal kick. <laughs> 23 minutes. Play. Benstead prepares to kick. Still Chesterfield nil. Sef United nil. Good head by Hewitt. But it's Booker. Into the chest for half, kick clear by uh, Slack. Bloomer to Brian. And another foul by Pike. Good position for uh, Chesterfield. with this free kick flags up for offside Bensley, Bensley kicks, good head by Prinderville. Out jumps Duffield, but it's Smith with his throw into Todd. Centre field, good head by Shaw. And a good uh, ball to uh, Agana. And also a good uh, shot, but uh, safely covered by goalkeeper Leonard. Agana. Halfway line, Morris, a good back head up towards Ely, covered by Pike. But he gets away, ball down the right hand side. Shaw's trying to get it onto Ely, runs away from him again. Chance, Waller to his left to Ely. Cross coming in. Morris stood in an offside position, spoils another good attack. Another lovely ball from Hewitt to find Waller open in the penalty area but we've got a player down injured.
who had been the victim. Looks as though he's going to knock at side of the edge. Benstead high, right hand side. Head by Hewitt down the left hand side. Waller trying to get in on the end of it. But Thompson once again covering. Shaw puts it back to Morris. Well, good work, bad luck, but once again, Thompson comes uh, to the aid of the defence and it's a uh, throw in to Chesterfield. It's a Chesterfield throw, but uh, the linesman's been overruled. by uh, Shaw, but the uh, referee indicates the foul has been uh, made on uh, Booker, who looks to me as though he's about six inches taller than Shaw. So Thompson seems to be involved with uh, everything in this uh, Sheffield defence. So this will no doubt be directed towards Deans. A good head out by Bryan, comes to Agana. Bloomer coming away with it. Todd's trying to cut him out. And this, no doubt, will finish up with goalkeeper Benstead. Kicks high. Hewitt forward. Thompson's underneath it. Towards Druffy, Driffield. Ah, good ball. Good intentions by Prinderville. Comes back to him. Towards good ball. To Morris. Tries to get the game uh, going, but once again. The flag is uh, up for offside. <laughs> Good head this time by Booker to Deans, but Prinderville covering. Puts the long ball forward, Morris inside, picked up by Thompson. His goal goes forward, it's slack to Hewitt. Down the line for Morris, but Thompson's going to be onto it first. And uh, Morris manages to get a foot to it. So a throw in by the right hand corner flag, defending. It's Thompson towards Booker. But, uh, Deflects off uh, Shaw, not quite halfway inside the chest of a laugh. The Thompson once again with this throw. Good head by Prinderville to Bloomer, but uh, Bloomer didn't get much direction behind it. Goes out, another throw in. Gaining ground all the time with these throw ins. Thompson towards Booker. Good head by uh, Shaw, but uh, gained about uh, 25 yards in the chest for half. Down the right hand side to Dean. Face past Prinderville, cross coming in. Cut out by Earl. Jamie Hewitt pondered a bit, gave to Prinderville. Upfield, cut out by Smith. And it breaks just nice for uh, Morris. And a good uh, back uh, kick by Stanicliff. Finds uh, goalkeeper Benstead. Oh, 
out towards extreme right. Good head by Hewitt. To Morris, keeps it in play. Nobody to feed on to. And inside the chest full half, Slack puts it out for a throw in. It's Driffield with a quick throw to Agana. Near the right hand corner flag. And Prenderville with a good uh, sliding tackle. Puts it out for another throw in near the right hand corner flag attacking. The long throw, this one by uh, Stanicliffe. Bucker's going in onto the near post. Comes out to lose to Agana. And it's cleared by Brian via a deflection of Agana for a goal kick. 33 minutes play of this first half and it's still deadlock at Saltergate. Good kick, Bolle, Soberwaller, but it's uh, Stancliffe, a wild uh, clearance, but uh, Hewitt goes, uh, puts the ball forward to Waller, comes loose to uh, Prinderville, but it's uh, too long, and it's Martin Pike makes a little bit of a mess of it. Quick throw, lad, come on. To Bloomer, back to Ely. Tries to feed Earl, but it rebounds back. Healy back in possession to Morris, to uh, Bloomer, and a good ball in near the six yard box, safely held by Benstead, and it's uh, Prinderville, good head, bike, but uh, Bloomer hadn't uh, got bike in time. So Benstead with this kick, Tool brings it down. Square to Slack, but it's Pike down the left hand side, cut out by Ull. Brian cuts it out as it was intended for uh, Dean, but uh, trying to play this ball out of trouble. Chesterfield and Ull, a beautiful ball to Waller. Shot! Yes! A lovely goal! And Chesterfield take the lead in the 35th minute. The Chesterfield supporters have appreciated that one. It's taken a lot of tension now away from some of the home supporters. And this throw to Morris, picked up by Stanicliffe. Not a very good uh, ball forward. From the throw, Morris tries the back head, but uh, it's in the chest full half, Slack towards uh, Ely. Still backwards and forwards. And a good overhead kick by Slack. Finds the uh, touch. So throw in on the halfway line. Taken by Pike. Down the left hand side. Towards Ogana into Dean. Into the chest full penalty area. Headed out by uh, Prinderville. Gets the deflection and cleared by Shaw. Throw in down the left hand side, quickly taken. Cross coming in, coming out wide. But it's. Uh, Hewitt was trying to play the ball and Booker fell over his feet, but the referee indicates deliberate. So a good position. Sheffield United. Todd stood over the ball with Driffield. Uh, Duffield. And uh, 
well cleared by uh, Slack for a corner down the left hand side to be taken by Duffield to no doubt be a right foot in swinger but it certainly got the crowd going once again headed out goes back to Duffield another right foot cross coming into deflection Morris and the goalkeeper go for it and it's uh, Bloomer Todd's on the ball to Duffield back in the penalty area where Dean is in an offside position. Another good long kick. Smith gets head to it out to his right, but it's Hewitt to Prinderville. Short one down the left hand side. Hewitt tries to get in possession with Prinderville. Cross, but it goes out for a corner. Doing some uh, very good work in these last few games, Prinderville. He's uh, been involved in defence and in attack on a number of occasions. So it's going to be a right foot in swinger by Hewitt. Another goal now would be uh, very welcome to the Chesterfield supporters, that is. 39 minutes of this first half. Headed out, comes back to Hewitt, chip in, headed out by uh, Dean. And there's a long ball upfield covered by uh, Hull. But uh, follow through by Agana has been punished. The, uh, it's a free kick. On the halfway line. one by Brian, it's going out of play, it's a bit too long for the goalkeeper. And stayed over the halfway line to Agana, picked up by Shaw, oh and there we got another good ball, cut out by Thompson as well as going on to it and Shaw picks up a ball as it goes into his half. Once again, it's Thompson. And he makes a mistake. So, putting his own team in trouble. But it's the first mistake that the lad's made. Another right foot in swinger by Hewitt. Short, kick clear, Prinderville's going to put the ball back, but it's a bit too long, goes out for a goal kick. by Hewitt to Morris out to his right but uh, it was Pike who tried to get a ball forward deflects off uh, Ely throw in taken by Pike Earl underneath it but it's Todd picking up it's Bryson tried to get through but uh, dispossessed by Shaw a good long ball to uh, Morris cut out by uh, Stanicliffe back to his goalkeeper kicks Going to be picked up by Ely, obstructed, but it's the Garner to Pike, still in their own half. Outfield to Dean. And the try ball forward deflection, cut out by Brian. 
and it finally goes out for throw-in down the line of the penalty area left hand side Pike Booker back edge Agana gets the foot to it a foul on uh, Prinderville but Hewitt gets the ball clear to Hewitt Prinderville a ball forward but uh, it's an hopeful one just relieves pressure Benstead kicks long Agana gets a touch, uh, Dean gets a touch to Agana, out to Bryson, Chip coming in, cut out by Shaw to Todd, it's in the penalty area, and a good clearance by the goalkeeper. But the ball's back into the central penalty area, Shaw gets it out, picked up by Todd, and uh, not a very good ball by Todd, his intentions were good, but the execution wasn't as perfect. So, coming up to the first 45 minutes of this game, Chesterfield 1, Sheffield United 0. A good head by Morris from this goal kick. Comes loose to Booker, tucks it up into the air to Bryson. Inside to Agana, but it's cut out by Hull. Throw in by uh, Pike towards Agana. Goes over Agana. Bryson's trying to get in, and it goes out for a throw in to Chesterfield. Slack also getting through some good work in the Chesterfield defence. So level with their own penalty area, right hand side, Hill to Morris, tries to turn, picked up by Stanacliffe, but goes off him for another throw in near the halfway line. Hull, Morris back heads to Ely. Ely's trying to get round Pike, but uh, the foul is being given against Ely as Pike kicks towards Dean. Back heads to Agana, comes loose to Hull, upfield to uh, Waller, taken out by Thompson. That was a bad one. That was a bad one by Thompson. If anything deserved a booking, Thompson deserved one for that one. free kick a lot of running about Swaller headed out by Smith shot by Shaw deflects no danger Benstead kicks the long one towards Booker heads on to Agana ball to his right to Duffield close down a good tackle by uh, Prinderville. Throw in half inside, chest for half. Smith to Agana. Left foot cross coming in. And it was a good head uh, out.
referee is checking his watch and uh, I should imagine he'll be blowing any minute now. Good head by Thompson, picked up by Prenderville. Tawala runs away from him, just couldn't quite control it. And Todd puts the ball forward, picked up by Prenderville. Tawala just couldn't keep it in play. And it's coming up to three minutes of uh, injury time. Good head by Shaw, but out for another throw in. And a good head by uh, Slack to Morris, picked up by Thompson. Back to his goalkeeper. Surely the referee must be blowing. Benstead kicks, picked up by Ely. And uh, that will take a few seconds. A good half for uh, Chesterfield. They've defended very well. They've attacked. And a wonderful goal has been the result of it. Good play down the right hand side with the ball in. It's uh, forced the goalkeeper to come out. And Waller took the opportunity to put Chesterfield in to what, in my opinion, is a well deserved lead. again plenty of excitement uh, building up for the start of this second half Chef United long ball out to the left hand side cut out by Ely picked up by Pike side footed down but it's uh, uh, Slack and finally who puts it out for a throw in a lot of support for this uh, Sheffield United side as Pike puts it into the penalty area. Slack, good clearance. Bloomer misses it. Comes back into the area, back again. Safely held by goalkeeper Mick Leonard, who is proving to be a good boy. Good kick to Morris, brings it down lovely. Tries to get Ely going to Waller. Todd. And as the ball goes upfield, it's uh, play is brought back by referee Enrique. Directed towards the angle, just for punch here. It's Dean. And ball. But Terry uh, Ram. Referee Hendrick indicates a goal kick. Good 
Good kick. Highland it carried on by uh, Hewitt, picked up by Smith, back to his goalkeeper. But uh, the breeze is beginning to get a little bit stronger, as indicated by that kick. Into the Chesterfield penalty area, added out by Hull to Ely. Bloom is trying to end of it, but it's Booker. But uh, using his arms, caught uh, Bloom in the face. Good head by Hewitt, uh, picked up by Thompson. And as the ball goes forward, it's Shaw. But the flag is up for uh, offside. Smith, long ball down the right hand side towards uh, Hagana. Kept in play by Waller to Hewitt, to Morris down the left hand side. Tight on the touchline, coming inside. Nice ball to Shaw, runs away from him. Still Shaw, but it's Todd. Cut out by Bloomer. To Ely, yes! Oh, and a good head by Morris. And it was a good diving save by Benstead. And that could have been two. But a good cross, a good early ball. Caught the Sheffield United defence out. A right foot in swinger from this left hand corner. Morris Backheads. And uh, gets a little bit too much direction on it. And it goes over for a goal kick. Instead, kicks over Booker and Shaw, picked up by Deans, but it's Bloomer to slack upfield a little bit too long for Morris, and it's put safely back to Benstead who kicks a good long one, well inside, successful half, but slack, good head to Shaw, dispossessed, and the ball inside the successful punch head, cut out by who? What a mistake! What a mistake by Little Hull. But the biggest mistake was made by number 11, fortunately for Chesterfield. The goal was at his mercy. Over the halfway line, Morris tries to get head to it, comes loose to Bloomer, Bryson, and uh, inside uh, Brian, Agana, ball to the right, shot, and it's a shot by Todd that uh, goes wide of the goalkeeper's left hand uh, post. Sheffield United putting a little bit of pressure on to try to get back this one goal deficit. Leonard to uh, Hewitt, Smith back to Hewitt and back to goalkeeper Benstead by um, Smith. And another good long ball. Good out by Slack. Picked up by Smith. Dispossessed by Miller. Matt Morris. Only for a throw in down the right hand side. A good long one. Brindeville puts it out. Pressure building up down that right hand side for Sheffield United. Thompson to Dean. Forced out. By Prinderville, but it goes off Hewitt for a corner down the right hand side. It's going to be a left foot in swinger. Seven minutes of this second half. Not a very good one. Kick clear, picked up by Duffield towards Pike. Tries a left foot cross. 
Headed out. Coming to Todd. Duffield. Bloomer. A good long clearance upfield. The Stanacliffe will put back to goalkeeper Benstead. Good long ball. Good head by Prinderville towards Waller. Smith's trying to get on the end of it. Back to Shaw, to Waller. Crossfield ball deflects off the referee. And a long ball towards the Chesterfield penalty area. Slack, a good head. Picked up by Bryson. Shot. Yeah. That's a beautiful goal. A beautiful goal by Bryson. In the good bottom left-hand corner. anybody's book. So, once again, the game is brought level. Throw in, cut out by Prinderville to Morris. And the foul has been indicated on the halfway line. But funny enough, Bryson, who scored with that terrific goal, missed the easiest one a few minutes earlier. Ball drops down to Prinderville, level with the penalty area. Goes off Smith for a throw in, quickly taken to Shaw. And the flag is up for offside. Kick by Benstead. Goes over everybody. Comes loose to Shaw. Was back in the penalty area. Bryson gets the head in. And as the Ghana tries to follow, Brian's covering. And at the same time, well held by Leonard. Flag is up for offside. Bryson, the goal scorer, hadn't got back in time. Centre circle picked up, loose ball by by Shaw to Prinderville. But uh, flag is up for offside. Halfway inside the uh, Sheffield United half, Thompson will be taking this free kick. Ten minutes in the second half, 55 minutes overall. Chesterfield one, Sheffield United one. Good head by Shaw. Here it gets head to it, picked up by Booker. Ball going uh, down the right hand side. And it's Slyke under pressure from a Ghana, puts it out for a corner. So danger building up for Chesterfield. It's a left foot in swinger short. To a Ghana, chip in, headed out by Slyke. Waller will pick it up. And it's Smith, puts it back out to the left hand side. But at the same time, the flag was up for offside. with his kick directed towards Morris, back head to Ely, tried to get Bloomer, 
but it's Todd, but uh, Ely, with a good ball down the left-hand side, but Ely, uh, Hewitt, had gone a little bit too uh, quick, and the flag was up for offside. Another long kick by Benstead, out to right-hand side, a good head by Shaw to Hewitt, Chris Duffield with this throw, quickly taken. To Garner, shot, goes out, caught a deflection. So it's a corner down the left hand side. No doubt taken by Duffield, be an in swinger. across and uh, kept clear by uh, a mix up by the Hewitt and Bloomer and it goes out for another corner over on the opposite side it'll be Pike this time be a left uh, foot in swinger There's quite a number of tall people in this penalty area not a very good one kicked out by Waller picked up by Todd and cleared upfield by Prinderville to release pressure. Smith, long ball down the left-hand side, but once again play has been brought back for offside. Just a nudge from Booker to Todd, inside the centre circle to Dean, out to his right. Prindleville gets said to it to uh, Hewitt. Booker, uh, Boomer, Bloomer to Hewitt. And the ball just uh, saved from going through by Smith. Long ball down the right hand side, it's Agana and Brian. But Brian. Push it out for a throw in near the right hand corner flag, attacking. So another long throw coming in by uh, Stanicliffe. <laughs> Goalkeeper and a fist out. And kick clear, picked up by Todd. Ball out to his right, Hewitt gets the foot to it, stops it from going out to a corner. But it's Todd. Trying to put it in the chest for penalty area, but it's Hewitt. And once again, as they, as Agana tried to make his way forward, it's kicked clear by, I think it was Prinderville, for another corner. So a lot of pressure in this first quarter of an hour. It's going to be a throw in. And a back head straight into the hands of goalkeeper Benstead. Picked up by Booker as he goes forward, it's Prinderville that comes back again to Deans, out to his right. A long ball down the left-hand side is uh, not going to be caught. Go safely out for a goal kick. Of the halfway line, Bruni adds go to Ely. Down the right hand side, tries to get past Pike, deflects off him for a throw in to Chesterfield. Halfway inside the half, it's Sewell. Uh, to Bloomer, dispossessed by Agana to Dean, and a good tackle by Brian. 
throw in, quickly taken by Todd. To Dean up in the penalty area. Ryan heads out to his right to Hool. Outfield to Morris. Both players went for the same ball. It was an unfair booking for uh, Morris, but uh, puts Chesterfield in a defensive position. Morris goes up on the far side, gets the foot in. Still, uh, Morris keeps it in play, coming away with the ball. Unfortunately, runs away from him for a throw in. Near the right hand corner flag, attacking to be a long throw once again. Booking gets the ball. Agana. Turns, tries a shot, left foot shot, and it deflects for uh, a corner. 20 minutes of the second half, 65 minutes overall. As Duffield, it's going to be a right foot in swinger. Deep, headed out by Morris. Agana, good shot by Agana. Tits the crossbar, rebounds, the ball's out. Right hand side of the penalty area where Thompson's trying to get uh, room. Still being closed down, eventually loses possession, goes out for throw in. Brindaville, Booker gets head to it, it's going out to play. But start by Prinderville, playing safe. Another throw in, halfway inside, successful half, right hand side towards the Garner. Cross coming in from Thompson, he deflects back. Another cross goes out safely for a goal kick. Left-hand side to good backhead by Yule to uh, Ely in trouble. Bloomer to uh, Ule uh, tries to get a clearance, but it's Booker. The ball out to the right-hand side where uh, Prinderville misses. Duffield to Booker deflects to uh, Bloomer, but it's uh, Stanicliffe to Pike down the left-hand side, cut out by Bryan. Oh, and they had a look of the draw there. There's Pike. Got a rebound. Put a chip in towards the far post. But uh, fortunately for Chesterfield, there was nobody uh, following up. Yeah. 
Good kick out to you, it turns. Smith to Todd. As the ball goes forward, cut out by Prindeville. A long ball forward to Hewitt, to uh, Waller, to Morris. Still Morris. And uh, it goes off uh, Smith for a throw in. Deep in uh, the uh, Sheffield United uh, half. Throwing directed towards Morris, who set it out, and at the same time, a foul has been given against Morris. There's a substitution, who has been replaced at uh, right full back by uh, Lee Rogers. <laughs> 23 minutes of the second half with Benstead kicks, a good long one. Good head by Slack to Waller, a back head to Morris. And Booker once again going in on Waller. But it's uh, Sheffield United on the attack. Once more, a dangerous ball. Get a deflection. Once again, still can't clear it, but eventually uh, it looks like Rogers. But it's Todd. A long ball forward, but... Uh, Good head by Morris to Ely. Turns Ely, chip to Bloomer. And as uh, Waller was free in the penalty area, play has been brought back. But uh, Chibbing towards Morris, it's not cleared yet, Pike uh, gets to it, Bloomer, and uh, referee uh, judges Bloomer to have used his elbow. <laughs> Duffield, I think it has been replaced by Josephs for Sheffield United. And throwing quickly taken, Todd leaves it to Pike towards Dean, who's moved out into the successful punch area, coming loose. Wallace trying to get clear and eventually comes out for a throw in once again. Sheffield United. Directed towards Dean, it's uh, going towards the Ghana. And once again, the referee judges that the foul has been committed, but uh, it would appear that the foul has been given to Chesterfield. And head kicks, head by Pike. Rogers just inside the chest for laugh. Goes out to play off Stanicliff for another throw in. This time halfway inside the Sheffield United half. Plenty of bodies. 
Morris eventually. Yes, cross coming in. Kicked out for a corner. Well, good work once again by uh, Bruno. So, the corner kick at the other end. Healy, the right foot out swinger. In the 27th minute, chip in towards uh, Morris, but uh, the referee has uh, stopped play to have a word with uh, the policeman. So the ball put back in the D. It's a good one. Back end. Yes! Yes! Oh! A back end by Bruno and an overhead kick by Waller. Deserved a better fate. It looked destined for the bottom left hand corner. Agana comes loose to Morris, but it's Stantliff up to Josephs, to Booker. Return ball to Francis. Brought down by uh, Brinneville. Dangerous position for Chesterfield. It's going to be right, left foot in swinger. Well by the goalkeeper on the second attempt. But it was a dangerous brawl. Long kick. Good head by Morris to his right to Ely. But Pike gets a foot to it. So does Todd. Goes out for a throw in to Morris to Chesterfield. It's Bloomer. Being held by Pike. But uh, the referee overrules the linesman. Free kick given, quickly taken by Pike to his goalkeeper on the half hour of this second half. Chesterfield one, Sheffield United one. A good long ball, a good head by uh, Brian. But it's only out for throw in, taken by uh, Smith. Down the line to a garner, it looks like. And uh, foul has been indicated by the linesman, by the left hand corner flag defending. I think it is Sagana. But the referee ignores it, goes out for throwing throw in Chesterfield Morris over Morris. The long ball inside the Chesterfield half. Brian heads to his left, carried on by Prinderville. To Hewitt, to Waller. But it's a long ball back by Thompson to his goalkeeper. Another good long kick well inside. It's just for laugh. A good head by uh, Rogers. Pike gets to the ball before uh, Ely, but uh, it's a throw in. Halfway inside, it's just for laugh. Right hand side, Rogers to Morris. The ball down the right hand side. Wallace trying to go on the end of it, putting Thompson in trouble. Lee Rogers gets the ball back. A good cross in, but Ely, but uh, the linesman is the judge of uh, the ball that crossed the bar line. Oh, 
bench said. Good head by Rogers to Deans. Ball down the line to Agana. Covered by Brian. Left foot cross coming in, but uh, couldn't get enough uh, uh, angle on it. Goes out for a goal kick. Leonard kicks high. Morris tried to get it to Rogers, cut out by Bryson. Uh, Rogers recovers to uh, and uh, Bryson is being uh, uh, charged with dangerous kicking. So a free kick just inside the half on the towards the extreme right touch line. <laughs> Set it out, comes loose to Bloomers, back in again. Force the numbers, Hewitt. Post the ball back into the area, but uh, once again, the flag is up for offside against uh, Waller. Free kick and straight into the successful penalty area where Rogers puts it out to Shaw. Good ball from Shaw to uh, Ely. And uh, as the Sheffield United go forward, it's Pike, but uh, it's a little bit too strong and goes out for a goal kick. Todd picked up by Morris out to his right to Ely, cutting inside. Push the ball out to Lee Rogers. Cross coming in. Go is Morris! Yes! A lovely goal! the field into a deserved lead. A good ball from the right hand side. And Morris and Waller both forced it over the line. But I'm sure it was Morris's goal. 80 minutes played, Chesterfield two, Sheffield United one. Throw in by Pike down the left hand side to Agana. Brian covers, long ball picked up by Todd to Deans to Agana, but cut out by Slack for another corner down the left hand side. It's uh, Duff, uh, number eight, Todd, right foot in swinger. It's deep. Headed out by Miller, by Morris, on the near post. So it's a right wing uh, down the left-hand side. Right wing, uh, right foot in swinger. Deep once again, punched out. Hewitt clears. And sounds of jubilation from the Chesterfield supporters. Throw in down the right-hand side, picked up by Deans to Josephs. Going out to play, kept in, and it's uh, Thompson who headed the wrong way. Bloomer to Ely, still Ely, inside to, uh, to Morris, cut out by Wynn Stanley, back to his goalkeeper who kicks, head on by Dean. 
But it's Rogers, not a very good clearance. Back to Bryson, and the ball that uh, Brian had uh, just couldn't quite clear as it had been bowled over, but it went safely through to goalkeeper Leonard, who kicks high. A good deep one. Morris, a good back head to Waller. Out to his right to Ely. Gets across in, lad. Oh dear. Didn't uh, get uh, round it enough for uh, uh, Kevin. <laughs> 83 minutes. Benstead kicks. Good head by Ely to Waller. And uh, deflects from uh, Stanicliff. Long ball back to Benstead. A good high ball. Coming loose to Brian. Another long ball forward. Going out to play for a throw in. To be taken by Pike. Back to his goalkeeper. Benstead, good long kick, right hand side, good head by Shaw, picked up by Todd, and Brian back again, Pike returns the compliment, picked up by Rogers, but it's Todd, and a foul surely by Agana, only Rogers, and the referee agrees. <laughs> I say. <laughs> so can we keep them out during these last five minutes? Leonard, a good ball forward, picked up by Stanacliff. And Lee Rogers allows it to go out to play for a throw in down the line. Morris holds, turns. But it's Pike with the ball, but it's. Uh, Slack to Brino, inside a shot, deflects. Still trying to get on the end of it. And it's Bloomer, chip, oh! Good work inside that penalty area by Bruno, by Bloomer. Finishing up with another corner. Two Chesterfield down the right-hand side. Bruno on the near post, Waller on the back. You hit a good deep one. Safely, Albarga, the goalkeeper. Throws out to Pike, number three. Sheffield coming up in numbers. But it's not... Uh, plays the ball out to his right, to Josephs. And a good uh, tackle by Prindeville. Saves the situation. Push it out for a throw in on the right hand corner flag. 86 minutes. Coming out loose to Bryson. Still not cleared. It is now to Waller on the break. And it deflects off Smith for a throw in. So we need to keep possession. Good throw up towards uh, Morris to Waller. Goes out for another throw in. Just inside the Sheffield United half, Prindeville. Directed towards Morris, a good head inside. But Stancliff puts it back to his goalkeeper, and it's going to be a good long kick. Brian heads to his left. Bryson brings it down, good control. But tried to put the ball down the line for Josephs to run on to. But can only put it out for a throw in to Chesterfield on the left hand side. Level with their own penalty area. It's cut out to Dean. Shot. Good snap, left foot shot by Deans. A little bit too much power behind it, otherwise it could easily have dipped. A 
88 minutes of play. Chesterfield 2, Sheffield United 1. Hewitt from the goal kick. Smith back into the chest for half. But it's uh, Hewitt. It's uh, Waller. Hope field, but unfortunately, Morris was caught offside and uh, this free kick has been taken only five yards inside the Sheffield United half. So Smith directs towards Thompson. Shaw's trying to get in the end of it. And it's uh, uh, Bryson, chip into the penalty area. Coming loose, shot by uh, Stancliffe. It rebounds off uh, Bruno, it's Agana. Back to Pike. Cross coming in deep. Headed out by Slack to Bloomer. And it's a good long clearance. <laughs> 89 minutes. Pike takes his throw to Agana. Inside to Dean. Cut out by Brian, picked up by Ely. A good ball. Once again, Morris was loose, but the flag was up. Rogers caught. Uh, It's not Rogers. Can't see who it is at the present moment. It was Brian. But uh, we're on 90 minutes of normal time. Benstead kicks a good long one. Good head by Slack, kicked out by Morris, picked up by Booker, out to his right, chip coming in, safely, oh dear. Brian should have left it to his goalkeeper. We're under pressure in this last minute. Left foot in swinger. Deep, coming out wide. Sagana, overhead kick, and it's cleared, upfield by Waller, picked up by Smith, and it's down the right hand side, coming out to Ely. Long ball down the line for throw in. Brian, tempted clearance, it's going out for throw in. And I make it. Uh, a minute over of injury time. Stanacliff with this long throw. Headed out by Slack. Picked up by Waller. Long ball upfield to Morris. Brought down by Smith. Silly thing to do because it's wasting their own time. minutes of injury time. Yes! A good win for Chesterfield. A goal by Morris in the 35th minute of the second half. And that was followed. That was another goal by Waller in the first half in the 33rd minute. But what a good result for Chesterfield. The crowd are absolutely ecstatic. Been a good fight back, especially after United drew level with a perfectly good uh, goal. Well struck by number 11, right into the Chesterfield bottom left-hand corner. 
But four goals in two games now for Andy Morris. Everybody was looking forward to the to the famous Patrick, first time uh, in league football player, which was one of the achievements of the point. Actually, I, I did things that you were know, uh, second uh, the line. So, uh, so, uh, so uh, we're looking forward to now in regarding to the next few matches. The last game is obviously a Monday game suspended, so... Well, thanks a lot, Andy, and for the benefit of the focus group. Every best wishes for the rest of the season. And also, take a few more. A good result today from the Chester's point of view. And also two excellent goals, three points. What uh, were your impressions of that first goal? Uh, I seem to have a figure of Beasley on Mark, who's so always like spam. And he played a great ball into me, and the def defender and the keeper got mixed up with him, and that was meant to be scored. And he really did a great ball with Max Bell, and he filled with a lot of points. Three of my points, sorry, followed around the area. Okay. Hello, Barry Watson, Chesterfield director. For the benefit of the Chesterfield Supporters Club, what do you think of that marvellous win today? Absolutely brilliant. One of the best times I've ever had in my life. That's what we're going to keep doing. And for next, just keep up this time and next season, watch us go. Don't you think that Chesterfield did very well to come back after that excellent goal by Wilson? The number 11 for Sheffield United. Absolutely superb. I think we went for a little dodgy patch, but we come through, we kept trying, and we'll keep trying. Thank you very much, Barry. Pleasure, John. I know that we're going to be able to do this every match, home and away, for the future. You mean Thank winning, you. of course. And, of course, winning at the best. same time. Thank you. Uh, Chesterfield Director. What do you think of this marvellous win against Sheffield United today? I thought it was a great win today, a great performance by the lads. Um, no, didn't enjoy the last five minutes too much, but I enjoyed Bethany's whistle at the end. Well, I should imagine that your palpitations went through the ground for a number of young supporters. But at the same time, uh, I thought that Chesterfield came back very well after a lot of pressure in the second half, especially by an excellent goal scored uh, by the number 11. Well, yes, I think that's right. I think it was, and I think it was looking towards the draw at one stage till we went and sorted that goal out. But I think in the in the final, uh, Chesterfield fully deserved uh, three points. Yeah, we played well. We took the game to them. Yeah, fully deserved three points. Well, we'll get many more now, straight to the end of the season. Thank you very much, John Crowe, Chesterfield. Now, as you all know, and you don't need any introduction to Barry Ovid, our chairman, and I'm sure that uh, after today's game and uh, the way the way that Chesterfield played, I'm sure he's fully satisfied with the three points that uh, we eventually managed at the finish. What did you think of the fight back after Sheffield United had put her under so much pressure after an, early, after an equalising goal? Well, we obviously did very well, but. Uh... The thing that stands out is the fact that two months ago or three months ago we'd have gone down five today. Uh, we came back and we all thought we'd come back and get, I, get two today. I don't know why I thought we'd come back. But the main thing is that we stood the pressure 
they're a very, very good side. There's no taking it away from them. It's the best side we've seen this season. But uh, we stood the pressure. Uh, we had perhaps a little bit of luck, I don't know. We missed an open goal. They missed perhaps two open goals. But uh, at the end of the day, you've got to have a little bit of luck. And it's now Easter. And perhaps it's the first bit we've had all season. Uh, I, I, the one thing, thing that I felt that came out of this game, and I'm sure that we're all very pleased with it, was the character that came out. That's right, that's right. That's right. By, you mind, we've got television here. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't... By the character that came Thank out you. by a number of uh, Chesterfield players, and I felt it was a good all-round performance. Yes. More or less equal to the final win against Cardiff. That's right. Uh, the 4-0, which uh, was an excellent result for Chesterfield. That's right. Well, it was a good result. It was nice to see Saltergate full, which is uh, very, very important. And I've heard that you've done the commentary on this uh, uh, video yes. today. So I just hope that you've had a good day. I have had an excellent day. I've had a day. good day. <laughs> All the supporters have had a good day. Nobody's had any problems. True. I'm going to the executive club now. I'm going to have another half of bitter. And I hope that next time we have a video, you can do it again. So then we can win another. Well, I, okay. the only thing that I'm hopeful for, Barry, is that we can do this. It's a venture that I think Chesterfield needs. It's going to bring a lot of interest to the Chesterfield uh, spectators, especially to the supporters club. And also, I, I think that the interest that it's going to create will no doubt bring a few more people back right. into the Saltergate ground. That's right. That's right. So I reckon that the supporters will buy this now with you on it because you're a star man. So you and me can go and have a pint and he can switch it off. <laughs> and then you can go and have a pint and then put the price up. Well, Dave, what do you think? Hang on, put it. <laughs> another manager. Dave Bassett. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. yeah. Are you ready? Yep. Yeah. Paul, <laughs> what do you think of this marvellous uh, victory today against <laughs> Sheffield United? Well, it's superb. We, uh, we had the best of the first half and played ever so well. And the second half, they, they, they had a storming start to it and they scored a goal in the first right. 20 minutes. Thanks, Dave. And we were up against Sorry. it. But uh, we withstood it and came through. Don't you think that uh, after the equaliser, it was a perfectly good goal, well, a good strike, don't you think that Chesterfield did well to come back uh, after all that pressure? We showed a lot of character. Um, the pressure that was put upon us was, was of our own making, I thought. We made some silly individual mistakes, uh, but we withstood it, we came through it, showed a lot of character. And. Uh, could have had a couple of goals after that. What do you think now in regarding to your next match at Huddersfield on Monday? <laughs> Could you say that a bit slower, John? That's at Huddersfield. We're right. <laughs> well, we've got to start winning away games. And uh, no better time than Monday. They've had a good result today at uh, somewhere at South End. 4-2. Mm -hmm. Have they? And they have done. Good result. So, uh, did you have a well, Didn't know that one. But they'll be buzzing a bit. Yeah, well, does this mean we'll go to place? So we'll, uh, hey? Does this mean we'll go to place? Yes. Does it? Oh, can't just can't just show, show, man, just show the bloody camera. <laughs> 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 you will be wanting a fee for it. Well, at any rate, thanks, Paul, for having a few words <laughs> with us. It's our first venture. We'll no, I can't, get, believe we'll believe we'll I can't believe it. I can't believe it. You're an old season hand of this. We'll get better as we go. So I don't know when it's actually going. When it's taping, there's two red lights instead of one. Right. Inside, there's one light, then red light. Toto Focus.